now uh, ask uh, Comrade uh, Ting Pei Ling uh, to start off to introduce herself. A very good afternoon, everyone. My name is Tin Pei Ling, and I'm 27 years old. I'm currently a senior associate with Ernst & Young Advisory Private Limited. I've been with Ernst & Young for the past four years, providing consultancy services to both private and public organizations. Personally, I'm someone who enjoys participation. I enjoy putting words into action, acting on ideas, and making ideas into reality. I'm the only child from a Chinese-speaking family. I grew up in a three-generation family. My paternal grandmother and my aunt have been staying with us <clears throat> since I was in kindergarten after my grandfather passed away. My parents are Chinese-speaking with primary school education, but they worked hard to keep the family together. My family relied on running a small eating house in the heartlands to earn a living, and I had helped to run the eating house during my student days, over the weekend, and very briefly when my father was uh, unwell. Um, through helping my parents with the coffee shop, I came into contact with people from all segments of the society, as well as a flavor of what it might take to run a small business. Now my parents are happily retired, and uh, I'm supporting them through whatever means that I, I can. Uh, I've also been married for three years now, uh, and I hope to start having my family, uh, have to have children in the near future. I've also been very active in the community as a volunteer in the last seven years. I was uh, actively helping out in the grassroots in the community, uh, taking on some active roles, such as with the Youth Executive Committee, the CDWF, which is Community Development Welfare Fund Committee. I've also been volunteering with, at the MPS Meet the People session at Ulu Pandan since 2004. As an MPS volunteer, I enjoy listening to the residents, understanding them, empathize with them, and help them with their problems in whatever ways I can. Of course, some cases are not that easy to solve, but I believe that with persistence, uh, many things can be done. And sometimes when, and at times when cases have been solved and that residents walk away satisfied, it, is also a sen it also brings me a sense of satisfaction. In, I've also been active in the Young PAP since 2004. Uh, more recently, I've been very privileged to be elected as the Holland Bukit Tima YP Region Chairperson, and I'm serving in the Young PAP Executive Committee in my second term now. In terms of causes, there are two groups of uh, Singaporeans whom I feel for and would like to focus on. Firstly, in terms of youth, I believe that a conducive environment for youth to focus on excelling and achieving their dreams and aspirations is important. I also think that youth actually have a strong desire to want to do good for the community and for Singapore, and I think we should help them do so. Um, in my experience in the grassroots, we've got students coming to us in the YEC with good ideas, wanting to help children from underprivileged families or just residents from underprivileged backgrounds. And often they, have, they come together with a proposal with some plan in place. And what, we, and what we normally encourage them to do is to come forward, we'll help them with the resources, we'll give them guidance if need be, and, but more importantly is to give them that rara, that encouragement to uh, help them do what they are passionate in. <clears throat> Second is on elderly. Um, I feel very strongly because when I see seniors, they remind me of my parents and my grandparents. So I will always imagine what I would do if they are my parents. So physically, I think, uh, I, so I think we need, it is important to take care of them both physically and mentally. Physically, in terms of basic needs such as food, shelter, health care. Mentally, in terms of uh, encouraging active aging. Hopefully, you know, they'll keep their minds occupied positively. And of course, I also feel very strongly that more can be done to encourage children and grandchildren to care for their aged parents. This would certainly be more meaningful and impactful to the elderly than any government or public initiatives can ever replace. So I, I'm very sincere and I want to step forward, step up to the challenge to represent the PAP and run as a member of parliament to serve fellow Singaporeans in whatever capacity I can. And I believe that with my youth passion and energy, I can, I can, I can step up to that and I want to do it for Singapore. Next, let me just do a brief introduction, very brief one uh, in Mandarin. 
大家好，我是陈佩玲，今年二十八岁。我目前就职于安永咨询有限公司，是一名商务管理顾问。我自小在一个三代同堂、以华语为主语的家庭中长大。我是家中的独生女。我的父母现在已是退休人士，所以我也负起了照顾他们的责任。我在基层服务了七年，一直都觉得为社区、为国家做出贡献是一件非常有意义的事。我认为，为人民服务最重要的是待人待心。只要有心，只要有诚意，就不怕难，也不怕会做错。所以我希望能借此机会，希望能够得到新加坡人的,的信心，呃，代表人民行动党。呃，出来竞选，为人民做出贡献，做服呃，为人民服务，谢谢。